you have a boyfriend? Why has your flexibility got worse now? Hey, what? <laughs> Whoa! Why'd you quit RG? I get this asked constantly. It is boiling hot in this car. It is quite hot. I wanted to pretend that we'd actually been somewhere, but we're just at home in the car. This I is literally in the driveway. Oh, I had to go out for the grocery shop and I'm back with the grocery shop and she's just sat in the car and she's like, Luke, we're filming it in the car. I wanted to be one of those stereotypical YouTube. You know that will make the wind in the... Okay. We're just going to have to suffer for a little bit. You know what video we're filming today? We're doing quick fire questions. We are, and you are firing the questions Wonderful. at moi. Think... I'm wearing a jumper, you're just wearing a top. Why are you, why are you wearing right? a jumper? Because got to get the merch in. The merch. Putting the merch as she like sweats Niagara Falls <laughs> down her face. Also, guys, this headband and these masks are from Elo Gear. We'll link them down below. They're awesome. They keep us safe, even though we're not going anywhere right now. So, uh, this video is so highly requested. I cannot tell you. I'm getting questions every day. When is the QA going up? I've kind of just been like, oh, it's coming soon. It's coming soon. They're like, today? I'm like, I haven't actually filmed it yet. So, but now we're filming it in, um, in an oven. A sweet release. Right. You can keep it open. No, though. mine's quite windy. I had so many questions, so we're just going to answer a few, and I'm going to try and do it in 10 minutes and make my answers as concise as possible. But I have to say, if there are ones that require longer answers, well, I I'll have cut to... you off. If I feel it's going, if oh. I feel it's not rapid enough, I'll be like, next question. I don't like pressure. Listen, welcome to rapid fire questions. Is that what is that the video isn't it? Quick fire. Quick questions. fire. Pow 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 pow. Pitting gun noises every time I said pow. Uh, that takes a lot of effort. Yeah. Well, guess what? There's some things you can't be quick fire with. <laughs> hey, beaut. Aww. It's weird because your, your name isn't Butte. Um, I was just wondering, have you had uh, many injuries? Um, I have had a couple of niggles, but nothing that stopped me from training for a long period of time. Wonderful. What is your favourite ballet? Oh, that's a hard one. Manon, Romeo and Juliet. What is the best thing yeah. uh, in your dance slash RG career? Great dance and Commonwealth Games and getting in Telmhurst. Would you ever have more merch or even your own leotards and stuff? Design here, Dare to Dream is coming back. Through I want mine. to do some good. If you didn't do RG or dance, what hobby would you have done? I love tennis, but I was so awful at it. You were awful at it. Beat her every time you played. What's your favourite colour? Sky blue. What would you recommend to get your leg higher in a a arabesque? Lots of stretching and strengthening equally. Both Do you important. have any pets? Uh, if so, what are their names? We had goldfish. Sparkles we had, we, and Eli. How do you remember their names? A uh, long time ago, but we don't... Uh, if you could get into any ballet company, what would it be? I can't remember forget. Oh, that's difficult. Three, I don't want to say. I'd be happy two. to get into any ballet company. Uh, what a Obviously, uh, What loves... ballet school are you going to in September? Elmhurst Ballet School. What was it like dancing the Sugar Plum Fairy with the Southern Youth Ballet? Incredible. I absolutely loved it. Who was your favourite dancer on Strictly? Oti Mabuse, of course. Sorry. But celebs, Danny Mac. I love Danny Mac. That was kind of deep. Do you want me to do the deep one? Go for it. I've struggled to be happy in my own skin and not judge or compare myself against others. That's that's tough. I constantly question myself every day, so I just want to let you know that we're all in the same boat and we all struggle and it's the way that we react to these feelings and emotions which make us who we are. So. If you ever think, oh, I'm not the best at anything, you're the best at being yourself. Like, I know it sounds really <laughs> soppy, but like, nah, mathematically, it's correct. Out of everyone on this earth, you are the best at being you because no one else has has the skills. What college, GCSE and uni subjects did you do? I think you've not gone to uni. Excuse me, <laughs> I'm gonna get a degree in dance. Oh, I'm gonna get I'm gonna get a degree in acting. It's kind of funny that we're both just getting degrees in like things that aren't real. Uh, uh, things that aren't <laughs> Disclaimer guys, dance and drama are both real subjects. I, I got A level in, in English literature and dance. Did your mum teach your, you rhythmic gymnastics? Yes, she coached me up to 15. How should I grow my YouTube channel? Consistency is key. K. Okay. Dream role. R uh, I was about to say Romeo. I mean Juliet. Juliet. I, Romeo's one of my dream roles, but like in the Shakespeare. In the original, not in the ballet. The original ballet. The ballet's based on the original. But the ballet also made it even more famous. Mm, uh, mm, arguably. Yes. Mm, yes. Mm. How do you deal with days when you're unmotivated? But they are really tricky. I still struggle with them now, but I deal with them by looking at my plan, what I've set myself for the week. Do you have different routines that you do daily? Different routines, like different daily routines, yeah, I do. I try and mix it up a little bit, but generally they're the same kind of pattern. Were well, you naturally flexible? For how long do you stretch a day? It's quite naturally flexible. I stretch for about 20 minutes to half an hour a day, but again, I have all my classes where I'm getting my legs up constantly. Do you, uh, what brand of point shoe do you wear most and what's your favourite brand? Merle's the brand that I wear, but I want to try some more when point shoes open again. Do you like Point Marmite? shoe shops open. Oh, I love Marmite. I hate Marmite so I much. I love Marmite. There's actually a video on my old channel that I think is private, but it's me doing the Marmite challenge. It's where I have to answer Harry Potter... Harry Potter... 
It's where I, I have to answer Harry Potter questions before I'd watch the movies. And every time I got a question wrong, I had to have some Marmite. This. You've watched the video. No, I didn't. That's a food challenge where you put yogurt in a sandwich. The, yeah, that one was years before the Marmite challenge. Did you put challenge. a spider in a sandwich as well once? No. no, Dad was like, you should do that. But then like, not eat, like, it'd be fake. And I was like, I'm not going to lie to the people, Dad. Mm. Any tips for pirouette? Practice a lot of balances. When you're choreographing a dance piece, what are the main things you think about? I try and think about the different levels, the different dynamics, and how it correlates with music. Music is a big thing when I choreograph. How do you always stay motivated during quarantine? Just to keep your eyes on the goal. Why did you want to start dancing? What inspired you and how old were you? I started, wanted to start dancing because my mum was a dancer, so that was in, initially what really inspired me to dance. How old were you when that happened? When I was born. There's a video of mum dancing with Hannah in her arms. like. What, she was dancing when she was pregnant. Oh, she was doing cartwheels. I mean, I was a fetus and I was um, dancing. Would you ever do Latin again? Probably I would. not. I'd but do Latin. But if, if I ever got in Strictly, maybe. I'd do Latin. I think that'd be great. For anyone who wants to be a good dancer, like you, um, I'll take that as to me. I know, I'm an amazing dancer. What advice would you give? Just work hard. There's loads of resources on the internet. There's no excuses. So just push yourself, push your limits, and always remember to dream big and make it happen. Yeah. <laughs> no, I'm joking. Uh, at what age did you start ballet? Ballet, I think it was three. Do you have a boyfriend? No, sadly not. How to handstand, please? Wish I knew. I can, I can handstand. That's one thing I can do better. Have you ever been in a place in your life you felt unfit and bad at dance? Every day. <laughs> it's working through those moments, isn't it? Yes, it's I think working it's, it's, through. That's what makes you, yeah, makes or breaks you. So it's make or break moments. Because I think everyone has that voice in their head that goes, you're not good at this, you'll yeah. never succeed. Tell her to be quiet and just I get on with it. I actually think you should just ask him the questions. Well, we are doing a Simpsons video soon, aren't we? Yes. When are you planning on living in your own home? Well, I'm, I'm moving. I'm moving to Birmingham for a school soon in a student accommodation. So I guess in September. What do you definitely. like shopping at? My my preference is Tesco. I'm a big fan Dance of Tesco. Dance by Central <laughs> online. Tesco. And Morrison's if I'm feeling fancy. M and S. I mean, I buy most. You know, I'd have Primark. to get a gun point to go to M and S. Primark. But we're we're cheapskates, really. How was quarantine? It's decent. How much do you dance weekly? Probably about 30 hours to 40 hours a week. Is it ever too late to learn how to dance? No. Do, do I need to add to that? Because that's just No, I was truth. just trying to think of a funny joke, but then I was like, nah, you know what? I love, I love dancers. How do you come up with dance choreography that's always so meaningful? She just asks me to do it. That's her secret. I actually choreograph all the dances. She just, she takes the credit. It's like in Let It Shine. I try and always choreograph a dance and then I put a poem to it, which gives it a, a deeper meaning for me. And it just comes quite naturally. Do you do your bros dance? I used to. He used to be in a street dance crew before I was. And my younger brothers do dance as well. Yeah, they, they, ballet. they do ballet. Have you ever watched Dane Mums? I think they're referring to Dance Mums. I have watched a few episodes, but I'm not too keen. No, I want to watch Dane Mums now. Dane Bates Mums. Oh, Dane, Dane Bates. New programme coming soon. What do you love most about ballet? Um, I love the fact that it gives you the technique for all the other styles as well. What was the most challenging routine on TGD? I would say Gladiator actually, even more than Latin. Latin was difficult with the shoes, but Gladiator was just so full on. I couldn't breathe throughout the routine and I was just recovering from being really ill. So that was probably the hardest one for me. Why don't you do tap, because Hannah? Just, Why don't you do tap? <laughs> I just never done it before. I never done it before. I've done a little bit of tap. I've yeah, taken it's a like everything that I can't do, you can do. Everything like, you can do, I can, I can do, do better. better. You know anything I can do better than you. And I can't sing either. Can you do chin stand? Can you do needle without stretching? Why has your flexibility got worse? No, hey, what? Whoa! Why do you quit RG? I get this asked constantly. Um, I'm still not quite ready to Three, talk about it fully yet, but two, it's down to a lot of difficult one. family circumstances. What's in your dance bag? A lot. You can watch my video, although my dance bag is different now, but you can go watch that video. See, I'll link it down below. Would you ever be a professional dancer? You know the thing you love doing? Would, if people said, let's, I'll pay you to do it, would you be like, oh, I guess? Of course, I'm, that's what I'm training hours for. <laughs> like, I'm not just doing this just for fun. Doing like, it for the art. What do you suggest I follow as I am a beginner? My beginner tutorials. Hula Hoop Challenge 0.2. Oh my gosh, no. If you guys have watched that video, you know I failed, but I would totally be up for doing another video with Sky again, because she's awesome. Do you do acting to help with your dancing? I should do. You should, I should give you some lessons. Oh, that would be a good video. Uh, who is your best friend? And there is a right answer to this. <laughs> when would you like to get a boyfriend? Huh? That's Maybe. not even written down. I'm just making, I'm making sure I can check. Maybe soon. I don't know because obviously I'm very busy, so I wouldn't be able to give a lot of time. But if I met someone, I wouldn't be opposed to. What's your go-to pose you know, for the pictures? Right person, person. What's your go-to pose for pictures? Anything flexible. Eating vegan for a day. I want 
want to do this video. I actually eat a lot of vegan food, so I, I definitely think that would be a fun one to do. Trying dance products from Wish and Amazon. I've seen videos like this and I really want to do it, so maybe soon. A collab with Harrison. I like really... a gift box swap. Oh my gosh, that'd be so fun. Guys, you need to tag Harrison in the comments. But not too much, not too much. Don't, don't, give him, don't give him any ideas. What would you say to anyone who is wanting to go on a TV show and dance like you did? Do it. To go for it. Dream big and make it happen. Yeah, and that's, that's the end of them. Oh, so hot. It's boiling. Guys, thank you so much for sending in your questions. Remember, if you want to send questions in, make sure to go follow me over on Instagram, Hannah Martin RG. And if you want the assumption video about like assumptions you've got about me, flood the comments. If you're one of my favorites, you know who you are. I want you to comment specifically asking for that video so that Hannah is forced to do that one next. So like, Hannah has no choice but to make that the next video that we do. As soon as this video is out, as it's premiering. I feel like you just need, just to, you need to start doing stuff on your own channel, mate. The world's not ready for that yet. Guys, thanks for watching, and we will see you very soon in my next video. Why are you shouting? Yeah, I need, I need an outlet, okay? Oh, just, your outlet should be dreaming big and making it happen. Okay, let's do a thumbnail. Now we need a thumbnail. I was going to do a funny joke okay. leaving the car, but you've ruined it now. Right, you've through. ruined my, my vision. I just want it to be funny for my favourites. and you've... Let's just do the thumbnail. We should do one where we're going to fight. Why? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> so guys, it is the big reveal. I am announcing my giveaway winner right at the end of this video. So some of you, I'm sure, have been waiting throughout that whole video to wait for us to finish answering those questions so you can know who the giveaway winner is. I randomly selected a comment from Instagram and YouTube. I put them in a hat. I picked one randomly. And the winner is... Drum roll please, BB Sims. Congratulations, we're receiving all those incredible prizes. Make sure to send me a DM on Instagram and I will get back to you. I wanna say a massive thank you to everyone who entered. There were so many entries and love to see so many people getting involved. I will be doing another one in the future so make sure to stay tuned. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Dream big and make it happen. Mwah.